Stella lived in a small village at the edge of an ancient, mystical forest known as the Starry Forest. Every night, the forest would shimmer with the glow of thousands of stars, creating a magical spectacle that fascinated everyone who saw it. Stella, with her curious mind and adventurous spirit, often wondered about the secrets hidden within those trees. One day, while exploring her grandmother's attic, she stumbled upon a dusty, old chest. Inside, she found a beautiful amulet shaped like a star, adorned with intricate carvings. Attached to the amulet was a note from her grandmother, who had passed away years ago. The note read, To my dearest Stella, This amulet holds the key to the starry forest's secrets. Use it wisely and remember, true magic comes from within. Love, Grandma. Stella's heart raced with excitement. She had always suspected that her grandmother knew more about the forest than she let on. With the amulet in hand, she felt a strange warmth and a surge of energy. Determined to uncover the amulet's secrets, Stella decided to venture into the starry forest. As Stella entered the forest, the trees seemed to whisper secrets and the stars above shone brighter than ever. She walked cautiously, her senses heightened by the unfamiliar surroundings. Suddenly, she heard a rustling in the bushes. Out flew an owl, larger than any she had ever seen, with feathers that glistened like the night sky. Hello, Stella, the owl hooted. I am Orion, guardian of the starry forest. Stella was taken aback. You know my name? Indeed, Orion replied. Your grandmother and I were old friends. She entrusted you with the amulet because she knew you would come. The forest is in grave danger, and only you can save it. Stella listened intently as Orion explained the ancient curse that had befallen the forest. An evil sorcerer, long ago banished, had left behind a curse that drained the forest of its magic. The amulet Stella possessed was the key to breaking this curse, but it required bravery and the help of the forest's creatures. Determined to save the forest, Stella agreed to help. Orion guided her to the heart of the forest, where the ancient tree of stars stood. The tree, once vibrant and full of light, now looked withered and weak. To break the curse, Orion said, you must find the five star gems scattered throughout the forest. Each gem is guarded by a powerful creature, and only through bravery and kindness can you earn their trust. Stella nodded, her resolve strengthening. She knew this journey would be challenging, but she was ready. With Orion by her side, she set off deeper into the forest, unaware of the adventures and lessons that awaited her. Their first destination was the glimmering pond, home to the water nymphs. As they approached, Stella saw the pond shimmering with an otherworldly light. The water nymphs, ethereal beings with flowing hair and shimmering skin, appeared from the water. We seek the star gem, Stella announced. The nymphs exchanged glances. To earn the star gem, you must prove your kindness and bravery, said the lead nymph. A dark creature lurks in the depths of the pond. Defeat it, and the gem is yours. Stella felt a pang of fear but pushed it aside. With Orion's guidance, she dived into the pond, the amulet's light illuminating her path. In the depths, she encountered the creature, a giant serpent with glowing eyes. Remembering her grandmother's words, she summoned her courage and used the amulet's power to calm the creature. Instead of fighting, she spoke to it kindly, learning that it was under the sorcerer's curse. With a gentle touch, Stella used the amulet to break the curse on the serpent. In gratitude, the serpent gave her the first star gem, its glow brightening the pond. The nymphs rejoiced and thanked Stella for her bravery and compassion. 
With the first gem in hand, Stella and Orion continued their journey to the enchanted meadow where the second gem was hidden. The meadow was a beautiful, colorful place filled with flowers that sang melodies in the wind. However, the meadow was also home to mischievous fairies known for playing tricks on travelers. As Stella entered the meadow, the fairies surrounded her, their tiny wings fluttering. Why have you come here, human? One fairy asked. We seek the second star gem, Stella replied. We need it to save the starry forest. The fairies giggled. To earn the gem, you must pass our test. Show us your cleverness and honesty. Stella was given a series of riddles and puzzles, each more challenging than the last. She solved them all with patience and wit, impressing the fairies. Finally, they presented her with the second star gem, praising her honesty and intelligence. Next, Stella and Orion traveled to the Whispering Woods, where the third gem was hidden. The woods were dense and dark, with trees that seemed to whisper secrets. Stella felt a chill as they entered, but she pressed on, determined to find the gem. In the heart of the woods, they encountered a family of wolves led by a wise old wolf named Luna. We protect the third star gem, Luna said. To earn it, you must show your loyalty and strength. Stella agreed to help the wolves with the task, retrieving a stolen artifact from a band of rogue creatures. With Orion's help, Stella tracked down the rogues and, using her wits and bravery, retrieved the artifact without violence. Luna, impressed by Stella's loyalty and strength, rewarded her with the third star gem. The fourth gem was hidden in the crystal caves, a labyrinth of glittering tunnels and hidden dangers. Stella and Orion navigated the caves carefully, their path illuminated by the crystal's light. Deep within the caves, they met a dragon named Draco, guardian of the fourth gem. To earn the gem, you must show your wisdom and compassion, Draco said. Stella listened to Draco's tale of loneliness and isolation. Using her compassion, she befriended the dragon, offering him companionship and understanding. Moved by her kindness, Draco gave her the fourth star gem, his heart lightened by their friendship. With four gems in hand, Stella and Orion made their way to the final challenge, the Peak of Stars. The peak was a towering mountain, its summit hidden in the clouds. The climb was arduous, but Stella's determination never wavered. At the summit, they encountered the sorcerer's spirit, the final guardian of the last gem. To earn the final gem, you must confront your deepest fear and show true bravery, the spirit said. Stella faced her fear of failure, recalling her grandmother's words and the lessons she had learned on her journey. With unwavering courage, she confronted the spirit, using the amulet's power to dispel the sorcerer's dark magic. The spirit, freed from the sorcerer's curse, handed Stella the fifth star gem. With all five gems, Stella returned to the Tree of Stars, her heart filled with hope. At the Tree of Stars, Stella placed the five gems in the amulet, their combined light radiating throughout the forest. The tree, once withered, blossomed with new life, its branches sparkling with renewed magic. The forest creatures gathered, celebrating Stella's bravery and kindness. Orion, proud of Stella's journey, declared her the new guardian of the starry forest. Stella returned to her village, her heart full of the adventures and friends she had made. The starry forest, once cursed, was now a place of magic and wonder once more. Stella's story became a legend, inspiring others to believe in their own strength and courage. And so, the magical quest of Stella and the starry forest came to an end, but the lessons she learned and the magic she restored would live on forever. Thank you for joining Stella on her magical quest.
Remember, the true magic lies within you. You can achieve anything. Keep believing in yourself, and the world will always be full of wonder and adventure.